right, welcome back to Tim's Inevitable Demise, episode 8. Let's go 8. Um, so, naturally, I could have left this cooking before, um, but you never know when you're about to get attacked. So, um, the only thing I did afterwards was I set the gold off, um, and then I accidentally still had it on for like a minute or so. And my Skype's going to keep making noises, isn't it? Um... I mean, it's it's just Joe being a penis, but he won't watch this, so it's fine. Um, I think I'm actually going to make um, those golden apples as well. Um, right, so we've got a chest plate, so we'll need legs and a helmet and boots. So there's the helmet, there's the boots, and there's the legs. So then we've got this as spares, or probably what I should just throw away. But I'll leave them in the chest, just for now anyway. Is, is a saddle craftable? I don't think it is. Horse armor definitely isn't. No, we'll go with it's not, but that's a bit annoying, because that, that would make things a lot easier. Oh, what am I doing? I need to pick that up. Right, so the only thing that... I need now, as far as iron goes, all I need is enough for an anvil, which is uh, to another eight or so. I think I only need eight more iron, but also I do need a saddle. Um, I will need to find a brown. Mushroom. I could probably find that in the Nether. Find the maybe I should think about going to the Nether. I do want diamonds, but maybe I should think about going to the Nether. Um, yeah, sure. Let's, right, let's let's try and go to the Nether then. Um, think I've got everything that I can possibly have. We'll try and create a Nether portal. I guess I might as well put it at the bottom. Why that lava right at the bottom here? Don't know. Don't know if I've got the space to, or if I even have enough lava for it. But we'll we'll try it. We'll see what happens. Um, I won't have much space. To do this wrong. I won't have like. Like if I get this wrong, then sort of game over, man. So I do have to get this right, and I'm going to be doing similar to the mold method, but not the mold method. Oh, it looks like I've got some spare lava over there anyway. So this shouldn't be too much of a big deal. Um, I guess then I should just start a new one over here, just so that I don't. Fuck that up. Oh, that's a good start. That is that is a brilliant start. Right, if we just throw that there. So those are the first four. And then we we want to do is wait, how high does it need to go? So one, two, three, four, it needs to go onto that level. So if I do that and then place that there, and then place that there. So we've got a full water full, I guess. And then we want to just place the lava here to make the... Oh shit, bollocks, fuck, shit! Okay, I'll take up the water to see what the position I'm in is. Because that obviously did not go as I wanted it to. Um, right, so we've got one, two. So that needs to go one further up. That needs to go one further up. And then it just needs to go across that bit. So I'll mark that. Uh, I'll pick up that lava. So I can place water there. So that when I do that, it'll drain to that bit there. Is that going... Oh, no, okay, now that lava's safe anyway. Okay, so it needs to go... We need to do more or less what we did before. Try and have a full wall of it. And it should just filter itself back to there. So that's not a massive issue. So we want to place one there. Don't screw me over. And we want to place one there. Grab some more lava. I 
don't really know where I want to place this now. And we've got two, three. I'm, now I marked a hole, but I can't see the hole. I think it's just that one and that one. And that is it. So if I can just pick up that water again. And we'll refill our lava bucket. So that is the portal. And then we just make ourselves a flint and steel. And kaboom. Um, there we go. Right, I thought I'd done something wrong there, but it, no, it was it just wasn't working. Right, so if we just make this a bit more sort of nethery, then we'll get rid of that bit. Okay, so we've got ourselves a nether portal. We want to be able to find. Uh, you know, what, I'm just going to go through it. Let's do it. Good luck. I don't have a bow, so I will have to try and hide from things. Um, obviously, I don't want to be attacking any pigmen, but I do need to find a fortress. I'm going to fall out of the world here, aren't I? No, okay, good. I thought I'd completely glitched out. Um, got a bit of nether lag naturally it looks like a pretty good portal spot actually because I'm not outside but there is just the outside there so we want to be able to find ourselves a fortress we want to find brown mushrooms and in all honesty I think that's pretty much it because we'll need I think it's just a blaze rod like one solo blaze rod and a brown mushroom I need, but I can get those on the surface, so right, see so yeah, if we'll just see if we can find a fortress. Let's put those out. I don't think I've ever been to the nether without having found diamonds. This is an odd experience. Also there is of course the nether lag issue that I have to deal with. And I do apologize for that, but there's nothing I can do. And if I encounter some lava issues in here, um, that will be pretty much sort of game over because it flows fucking quickly. Look how quickly that flows. How am I supposed to deal with that? Maybe I shouldn't have done it there. That was probably a really bad idea. Can it put out a portal? Probably not. Um and if that just disappears real quick okay great ah uh, it's gone over there as well okay brilliant that was absolutely stupid from my part but alright it will disappear it has disappeared um, I need to find a way out of this <laughs> I just dig up I don't know the normal height that you start at in the nether well, we are at 17. That does feel low. But I know you do start pretty low anyway, so we just sort of continue the same kind of fashion that we had been so... Fuck shit, bollocks! Right! <sighs> okay, so we, so we don't want to go that way. Let's, let's go another way. <laughs> um... That flows so quick. I won't be able to deal with that. And of course, you can't place water in the nether. So, I am going to be having some issues with this by the looks of it. Oh shit, there's more. Okay. How the fuck do I get out? <laughs> it looks like I'm underneath a lake of lava, which makes it very difficult to progress. Maybe I do want to go this way and we'll dig up here instead. Also you do want to dig pretty much the full stretch of your pickaxe by the looks of it because that lava is a bitch. Oh, it'd, be, it'd be really upsetting if... Oh. oh that was already my second pickaxe. Okay, I can actually make... No, I don't have any wood on me. 
okay, so we're going back. Uh, we've learned that we have a pretty shit nether then. It's, it seems fairly safe, but we can't really do anything. Um, we, we don't really have a way to go. It looks like we're trapped. Um, so that, that may cause some issues. May cause some issues. That will cause some issues. Oh, yeah, okay, yeah, no, right, pickaxe first. We'll make a couple. I think we've got the iron for it. I think I've got 16 on me. I'm not entirely sure. I think that's the number that came up. Um, we do want to find that blaze rod. And obviously the only way to do that would be in the nether. But with that kind of a nether, I don't really know how we'd go about it. I, hope, I guess I've just got to hope that one of the ways I go works. Um, I, I guess I'm pretty screwed otherwise if it doesn't. So uh, we'll just grab some more sticks. We'll make a couple of pickaxes. Obviously, iron doesn't have the best durability on it. What is it? F3 and H? No, is it F3 and J? No. Definitely one of these. Right, I just sort of pressed everything. Uh, no, okay, I've got no idea what it is. But I wanted to see its durability. Can't remember what it is. If somebody could tell me, that'd be great. Um, we'll just eat up again. Skype's gone off again. Um, there's not really anything else. In, I guess I've just got to go back to the nether. I've got to try and find that fortress. I mean, I might be right next to one. I could get really lucky. I won't be, but I could be. And that's kind of what I have to hope for, really. Um, please sort of ignore Skype here. Uh, yeah, I think we will. Put some more iron. We'll take the coal. Take the iron. Uh, yeah, well, maybe I should just take wood on me. That'd be a good idea, wouldn't it? Just a couple. Uh, we'll go back into the Nether. We'll continue the way I just tried on that third attempt. We'll see if we can get out, just so that we can have a look around. You know, probably not actually progress, but just. I say a, a look around, uh, see how things are going, see if we've got a fortress nearby because that'd be great. Although I feel I have already exhausted my luck for this series, um, but we'll have to see how that goes. We don't need that. One. Let's have some blocks there instead. There we go. Um, no, no, we'll go with that. Okay. Love the nausea from these. Okay, so we're back in the nether lag. I mean the nether. Um, I think it was this way we wanted to go then, wasn't it? Like off over here. If I take that out. This one up here and I started doing a way up just here. Don't know how far I made it. I don't think it was very far. Yeah, no, it was just here. And I've just got to hope that I don't get raped by lava I'd say it's looking promising but that's usually the worst thing you can ever say shit fuck well that didn't give me much warning that was like literally right next to me um, I do think though that I can just go around that this is probably a really bad idea I'll go two across because it looked like it was just coming from the side, which means it seemed like I can just go forward. Maybe I should have that there <laughs> instead. <laughs> Watch me try and then go to that empty space. I'll have blocks there as well, just for when I screw up like that. I'm hearing a gust, which means I must be close to the surface. No, there's more lava. There's a bit of nether lag. And that's that blocked. Okay, so I don't know how to get out here. Like, literally at all. Um, well, I've tried three directions. I guess there's another over this way. Can I mine that with iron? I can. Do I have any use for it? Probably not. I guess it's just more XP, though. Um, I don't 
don't know where to go. I'm just getting screwed over by lava everywhere. Almost feel the need to just try and make a new portal or start again. Thing, although I'm not going to be able to take this one up, so I'm just going to go back to the same spot. Well, I'm hearing fire, which means I'm definitely near the surface. The gas does kind of confirm that as well. However, near the surface could just mean under lava. Right, let's fire very loudly. Skype's still going off. That looks surface E. That's a surface. Okay, great. And that's obviously a lava lake down there. Okay, so we will just try and seal that off just a tad. If I can. This is probably going to be my death. Okay, no, we're good. Okay. So... <laughs> I'm I'm only really half the way that I want to get to. So, to be honest, if I just block all that off, then I've got the cobblestone as uh, sort of a point for me to know where I can then go. And then we'll just sort of continue back up this way as well. And then with any luck, I won't get too confused trying to find my way back out. Um, from the bottom of that bit where I ran across the more or less the level where my uh, portal was I shouldn't have that issue but I am pretty stupid right there's some more lava lake crap what height am I up to now 56 that's slightly more comfortable there's not going to be anything down there so I'll the, the nether is fairly desolate so it's like Unless you find a fortress, there's really nothing here. Unless you absolutely love glowstone, but it's not particularly great. So we'll just continue up. Well, I want to try and get to, you know, the actual surface surface that you can, like, you know, walk on and see shit. Rather than just looking out at other things. I'm hearing more fire. I don't know if they get lava at all heights in the nether. I don't really know nether mechanics too well. But there's a zombie pig man. I want to say I'm too high for lava now. So it should be relatively safe now, if not an absolute bitch for long journey. Right, okay, so we are out. What the fuck was that? I'm seeing things, okay. Um, so we've got... Hi. Um, uh, d d d nothing particularly noteworthy, I guess. Though it would be quite a search to try and find a fortress, probably. I oh, don't say I've lost my hole already. Ah, oh, crap. Okay, good. There's my hole. Right. Let's mark this with a pillar. <laughs> do we have more cobble? We do. Right. So that should make it a bit more obvious. Um, what I will do is I'll place a block as low as I can there. We'll go a bit higher. We'll place another one there. That's going to be my way back down. And I think that will be high enough because I'm more or less at the ceiling now. It should just cushion my fall enough because I wasn't entirely sure if I'd sort of survive that drop. But I definitely will survive those. Okay. <laughs> I say definitely. Uh, it took quite a bit more than I thought it would. But right, so we'll... I'll end this one here while I'm in this sort of little nether cavern I've got. And we shall try and 
organize something or do something to try and find a nether fortress next time but I will have to try and be able to map something so that I don't lose where I am which I am quite good at doing so I'll have to think of a system that is foolproof and I don't like my chances with that if I'm brutally honest um, I guess we'll block that bit off as well alright so thanks for watching this episode of Tim's Inevitable Demise and I'll see you next time where I probably will die.